Hey guys, welcome back to A Complicated Melody. I have a nice small haul from um, Ulta, but it's all NYX products. They have buy one, get one half off. They have like a little 20% off um, coupon, but I actually didn't buy any major things. So the 20% off came off like the most expensive item, which was like only $7.99. But I just wanted to show you guys some of the things that I picked up because the Ulta in my area, Baton Rouge, has a new expanded um, NYX section. So if you're in Baton Rouge you haven't been to Ulta lately, go check that out. They have definitely expanded the um, the section to like two more full kind of um, sectional thingies and so they have more products which is awesome. Now, one of the, the first product I'll show you is one thing that I didn't even realize that they made and this is the um, high definition eyeshadow base. So I have their regular eyeshadow base like so. I have this one and so this one is more of a consistency like a Too Faced Shadow Insurance or a um, you know UDPP you know, it's, and the wand is similar. I'll show you guys that. The wand is similar to UDPP. And so that's the consistency of it. And it just blends in nicely. I um, tested it in the store, and I kind of like the, the finish, the feel that you got, the texture. It was kind of um, not too thick or anything like that, and so I wanted to try it out. And I did my makeup at about 8.30 this morning. It is now 6 o'clock, and so far, the eyeshadow, and this is just a two eyeshadow look from the um, Naked palette. So this is just, you know, just simple two shadow look, and it's still there and no creasing so I guess so far first day test is really good um, I don't know how to explain kind of the texture like I would say just test it out if you can if you can see it but it's definitely so far so good as far as the primer this eyeshadow base um, the white with pearl I picked that one up because I have milk and I always said why would I get the white one but this one is like white with pearl so I decided to go ahead and pick that up since they were having the buy one get one half off and this one is kind of like you know I guess for shimmery eyeshadows even though I don't really go by that rule I use matte eyeshadow primers and then use a shimmery shadow because it's all for the same thing it's just something for it to stick to so that's what it looks like and so it's a little bit less opaque than milk will be but the consistency is a little bit thicker than milk sometimes you really have to work with milk the jumbo eyeshadow pencil to smooth it out before you put your eyeshadow on or else you will get creasing so this is more of like a real true base um, and so it's very shimmery so it'd be great for shimmery eyeshadow looks for sure. I'm also a big fan of NYX cream blushes their glow is like amazing favorite 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 uh, favorite 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 say that three times um, clearly I can't but <laughs> this one is called zero to natural and I really do like this color. It's just a, a very, very soft pale pink, kind of a little peachy, and um, that's what it looks like. And I, uh, I liked it when I tested it in the store, and then I used it the other day, and I liked it. It gives you kind of a nice, light, flushed pink cheek, so it's really cute. So lastly, I picked up three of the NYX Soft Matte Creams. I am so glad that they had this in the store because I saw a lot of people raving about it, but I didn't want to order it um, without testing it. So I was glad that they had it. One thing about these, they smell good. They smell like caramel or something like a candy. Caramel. It smells so, so good. So this color is called Milan. See that? And it is a actually it's a little bit darker of a pink it's not that pale of a pink but it's a pretty pink color I also picked up Antwerp and this is a light peachy color kind of corally it's actually what I have on my lips now the last one that I picked up is called San Paolo and it is a darker pink it's a really really nice pretty pink color and these have a really nice finish to them. Uh, they come off very matte, almost kind of like a matte stain. Um, no, just scoot up so you can see. So it is a matte finish. So um, I kind of like that. It's um, but not too like drying matte. No, you know, 
super dry look like it doesn't look like your lips are chapped which sometimes matte can do um you know some matte products do come off kind of looking like very very dry makes your lips look kind of chapped and these are really cool so i love these i'm going to pick up some more colors um they don't have they have like maybe 10 colors in the store i don't know how many they have total but in in the store for sure they had about 10 of them and um the this was 7.99 so it's like $6.99, $5.99, and these were $4.49. No, I lie, I'm sorry, these were $5.99 because they were six bucks. So yeah, these were six dollars. Um, but like I said, Ulta has to buy one, get one half off. It's a good time to kind of rack up on some of the NYX products. And um, if you have any questions about the products I just showed you, just let me know. See you guys in the next video.